Ladies and gentlemen, kings and queens, welcome back to another video, baby. <laughs> yeah, welcome back, guys. Um, so I woke up today, and I I woke up to a new The Last of Us Part One launch trailer, and it's so funny because yesterday I posted a video uh, uh of my review and reaction to um the Gamecom 2022 uh showcase that happened yesterday and I talked about The Last of Us and how like the game is coming out in less than two weeks and I'm like yo where's the trailers at where's the gameplay we need to see something so today we're gonna react to the new trailer that they dropped an hour ago <laughs> so let's let's see what they got for us right here boom let's see now Ooh, it looks really good. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know no girl. Ugh. Naughty dog. Wow. Where? It looks pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Wow. It looks like they made it better. Here's how this thing's gonna play out. You do what I say, when I say it. Joel, I can handle it myself. It's called luck, and it is gonna run out. That's less than two weeks, y'all. Too many of them! Oh my god. I wonder if it's harder as well, if the game is harder. Oh, they show a little bit more. They show a little bit more. Okay. Oh shoot. Do you even realize what your life means? Stop with the bullshit. What are you so afraid of? Oh. No! Nice. Last was part one. Wow. Wow. So it definitely looks better. This this trailer, this video, uh, definitely looks better. Look at the look at the visuals, man. Even this, I'm not sure if this is the same guy or nothing, but they whatever it is, they remade him, and the guy looks really good, really good. Everything looks cool. Of course, it's just a regular trailer. It didn't show. Uh, it says mix of gameplay and in-game cinematics, cinematics. So. You know, but it looks really good. That's 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 the thing about The Last of Us. That we're, okay, this definitely looks better than the original and the remastered. It looks really good. I love it. And in some of the gameplay in here, it definitely showed. Um, it definitely showed that it's, it looked more like um, The Last of Us Part Two. Is what I definitely liked. Um, is it worth seventy dollars though? You know, I'm not too sure. Like, shout out to my friend Jalisa, though. Um, she's giving me her early birthday gift, and she's um, helping me buy the game. So that's the only reason why I'm getting it day one, um, September 2nd, is because I have a good friend. Other than that, <laughs> I'm probably not going to buy the game right away. I'll probably wait for a sale. Maybe if it's $40, I would actually buy it. You know, I still hope that they would put something in place like that. Like, if you if you bought the game on your profile or something... Um, and you have proof of it, you know, you can get a discount of $40 for the game. I feel like it's, it's only fair. And I'm not discrediting what they did. I know they put in work into making this, but it's just, you know, they should have added to make this a new experience. But in, based on the trailer, there is a few differences in the cutscenes that we never had in the first one, in the original. So I give them props for those things. So it's still going to be a different experience, but... Our question for people that already play the game is like, how different will it be? How better will it be? Is the is the enemies going to be stronger? Is the enemies going to be smarter? Is the enemies going to be better? Are they going to be calling names as well as they did in The Last of Us when you kill a, kill one of their friends? Like, oh my god, Nathan, you know? So that's something to look forward to, you know? Um, but it looks good. I'm just kind of like going over the video one more time. This looks really good. I'm not gonna lie. 
really good. That scene was awesome too. I'm looking forward to I'm looking forward to this because I haven't played um, Left Behind in a long time, and to be able to play it at you know you know at the best definitive way of playing this game would be great. Here's how this thing gonna play out. You do what I Looks say. good. When I say it. Definitely. I would say the cutscenes and stuff definitely better. It's called luck, and it is gonna run out. Hmm. Uh, the main, the main part of the game is like if it looks good and feels good, it already looks good. But like if it feels good and and like you can have combos or something. Uh, yeah, this part, this part is new. That part right there, we never seen this angle where a guy throws something there and they're driving through, and then this guy throws a brick at Ellie. Like we never seen that, you know. So there's some differences that they, that they added. So I'm looking forward to seeing those things and some levels that look a little different than the original. So you know, kudos to them, you know. Stop with the bullshit. What are you so afraid of? But I also hope that they listen to us with certain things that, you know, we said, as fans said, that they, they're looking for in the game. And I really hope that they do make certain changes. Like the animations of Joel hitting people and stuff, punching people. I like the old animations, they're fine. They could maybe be fine-tuned a little bit, but add some new animations we kind of want to see, you know? Mm. That part is definitely interesting right there. The fact that, like, some clickers... There, there was no scene in The Last of Us, the first, the original, where clickers and, and, and runners were electrocuted. What are you so afraid of? Look at this. I've, we never seen this before, right? Like they 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 actually got electrocuted. Oh, is this is this in Left Behind? It's been a long time since I played Left Behind, so I I didn't see a situation where they get electrocuted. So we'll we we'll just have to see. But I'm the main thing I'm hoping for. This was a crazy scene, but the main thing I'm hoping for is the game feeling better, feeling harder, like in a good way like you know what I'm saying like it just feels more challenging the AI is actually smart and not dumb you know like that's what I'm really looking for because part two was amazing and if it could feel anything like part two this would be like a masterpiece of a game because part one was like the best not bad really good trailer I'll give it to them I'm looking forward to playing it uh, Friday you know Full screen, baby. So yeah, um, this is one of my favorite games of all time. Um, it looks like it's gonna be great. I'm all here for it. The graphics even looks more clean than the last trailers, even better. Yeah, it looks really nice. Um, you know, so like, I mean, I, I just hope it, it it plays nice. I hope it's worth the money. Um, I hope somehow there's levels where things are different and they added things that they just don't want to spoil it for us. Despite some leaks, you know, had that happened or whatnot, and I hope the game just feels better to play, and the, you know, the, the enemies are just smarter and, and it's just more fun overall, you know. Because I've been I've been watching, uh, you know, uh, other gamers play The Last of Us Remastered Online, and it's just fun to relive the story and be able to play it at the you know at the best graphics and you know, the better version of the game would be great. So this is my reaction slash review kind of <laughs> on the last of us um part one uh, launch trailer thank you so much for watching guys and don't forget to like share comment subscribe um tell me what your thoughts is in the comments let me know let's have a conversation and i'll see you guys in the next one all right